Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the NYC Order the Show. And uh, we in Spanish Harlem right now on the east side. I'm gonna be doing the First Amendment audit. On uh, not really really sure the the, the precinct name, but we're gonna find out right now. Come over here. Let's see. And I'm using my. My, my Nikon today, so I should get a better quality video. That's what everybody been telling me. So let's see. I had to stop using my phone for a little while. I'll let y'all know the name of the priest, and I forgot. I just know I'm on the east side, though. How you doing? My PD car just, just rolled by. See these guys in there. I hear a lot of cops in there. All right, 33rd precinct. We here. Members of the public are prohibited from audio and video recording or photography inside the facility. So, to look. Third precinct. They got that shit like right there so you can see it. So you can't be like, I can't see it. And uh I'm not trying to be a martyr. I know you guys want me to go inside, get get tased, get shot, but that shit is not gonna happen. And I value my life, I value what's going on. So you know. It is what it is. So these guys, I think we're gonna have some action here. I think we definitely gonna get some contact. Somebody just came outside. Look at these guys. <laughs> so good. These guys. And once again, we are here in Spanish Harlem, East Side. So, looks like, looks like they, looks like these guys are uh, respecting my right. They definitely heard me. They definitely saw me on camera when they came, they came out, they looked at me. So. So they got 23rd precinct here, and I think that's the. They came out that where they came out from. Let's see what these guys gonna say. How you guys doing today? How are you? Good, man. Zoom on this shit. Crazy. Yeah, these guys, I don't know they I don't know if they coming in to work right now, but it's they deep. These cops keep rolling up, man. Cops definitely rolling up deep. So we got, let me see, we got, so, let me go, this, this precinct look mad dead, they don't have nothing, no type of memorial here, nothing, nothing to, sh to show the public, but as we always see, courtesy, professionalism, and respect.
see what these guys look at these guys right here look at them you guys want to say something you can say something you don't gotta look look at these guys right here look they keep looking but they're not saying nothing look look at these two guys right here look at them crazy everybody's looking but nobody want to talk you can ask me a question I ain't gonna bite your head off I'm come back up here Officer, got a question for you if you don't mind. Alright, got a question. Now, you guys put a memo out. I'm not sure when you guys put it out about nobody can be recording inside the precinct. Yes, sir. Why is that, though? Um, uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's for uh, privacy. You just got to be careful with people. You can't just record. If somebody's coming in that's arrested, you can't just you can't do that, you know? But why is that? Isn't that my right to record anything from a public record, space? No, you cannot record inside the prison. No, no, I know. That, not inside, but that's not something that's been going on for a long well, time. Well, no, I'm asking that because I've seen something on YouTube, like maybe maybe like a year ago probably, when somebody was in the, uh, I think they was on the west side of Harlem, and they went in, and it was acting all crazy, and ever since that time, you guys put a memo out. That's not something that's been going on for years. I can't explain that. You're going to have to uh, ask legal bureau for that. Okay? I know. No, I just wanted to ask you. I just thought maybe you knew, but... Okay. Thank you for your professionalism. What's your name and badge number? Uh, Officer Cabral, 2573. All right, appreciate it, man. <coughs> All right. So, they put a memo out, and um, all the precincts all over New York City where nobody can be, can be recording inside the precinct. And um, they haven't, that haven't always been there. Because you can remember, like, other, like years ago, you can go in there and record and nobody will say anything. But now, it's like, you know, these guys are going to be watching me now. Watch. So, you got a sign right there. I showed you guys earlier about no recording, no audio. I'm going to try to, one day, we're going to, one day that memo is going to go away. And we're going to be able to record it. So, Looks like these guys get a pass though. Cause they didn't really a lot of them was looking at me, they didn't say anything wrong. You know, they didn't try to tell me I can't record. This guy gonna try to tell me you can't record if somebody's in there. If somebody brings or something if somebody gets arrested. Get the fuck out of here. That's some bullshit. You can record I can record anything I can see. If I can see it, I can record it. So but you know. Then he said inside. I'm like, I'm, I'm not talking about inside. I'm talking about. But I was talking about inside because I wanted to know if he knew. But he seemed like he really, really didn't know. So. Seemed like he really, really didn't know. But it's all good. I mean, he, he was able to tell me a little bit of something. So that's, I guess that works. So we got all these. NYPD squad cars and then got some cars over here that's not squad cars but definitely a personal vehicle of uh, NYPD and uh I used to actually you know what it's crazy because just just to let you guys know right we on the east side we on the east side and third ave right I used to live my father right back in 2000 I live right, let me see if I can kind of zoom in up there. Let me, see, let me try to zoom in. I live right on the fifth floor up there, if you guys can see that. This neighborhood has changed so much, man, since the, since early 2000. Got a lot of people, a lot of foreigners, a lot of different nationalities moving over here. Got a lot of whites, got a lot of Indians, Asians. It's crazy, and they still call it Spanish Harlem. El, or many, all my, all my Latinos would be like El Barrio. 
so all right well i'm about to wrap this one up so we was here at the 23rd preset in spanish harlem and uh that is it nothing else to show you guys nothing else to see so I was gonna ask him some more man questions but he kind of like walked off like he really didn't want to I don't know if he had to go back inside or what was, what was the issue but so we're gonna end this so thank you for watching please subscribe share the video like the video go inside like the video share it don't forget to hit that bell so you can see when I'm uh, gonna be putting a, when I'm gonna be dropping another video so you guys can always stay up to date with what I'm doing so These guys just looking. Let me should ask him something, but I ain't gonna, you know, fuck with him. It's always the next time for everything. All right, man, ladies and gentlemen, it's been fun, and uh, I'm out of here.